$100 million is up for grabs through the African American Quality of Life Initiative. It's a plan that's been nearly two years in the making. Yeah, but it's only for nonprofits wanting to make an impact. News 8's multicultural reporter Katira Winfrey has the story. Poverty impacts roughly 30% of Indiana's black population, and community members say a lot of that stems from issues surrounding lack of community investment. Now, the African American Quality of Life Initiative will focus on five areas with benefits that they say will cross ethnic lines. Solutions for critical issues impacting Indianapolis's black and African American communities are being developed. If we're successful with this grant here in this community, maybe the Lilly Endowment or others continue to invest in this effort. In August 2020, the Lilly Endowment allocated $100 million to the National Urban League. Hopefully, and this is where the African-American coalition can come in, can work on the policy issues that keep people from also being able to access fair and competitive opportunities. Placing those dollars into areas impacting education, employment, entrepreneurship, housing, and health. Tony Mason with the Indianapolis Urban League and Willis Wright with African American Coalition of Indianapolis say those critical issue areas are interconnected. Then you see the level of poverty that we have in our community. We talk about 30% of African Americans being, being poor. Uh, that means that uh, our neighborhoods are not invested in. That means you don't have access to jobs. So that means you don't have a health center. You don't have a grocery store. The Indianapolis Urban League and the African American Coalition of Indianapolis are the organizations that did some of the initial work gathering community feedback. Nonprofits that provide solutions to some of those five critical issue areas can start applying for place based funding now. We are a focal point to give some particular strategic direction. It is really a community effort. Mason says the hope is to address the issues and potentially secure more funds to do more. The application deadline to submit proposals for grant money is April 22nd. Reporting in Indianapolis, Katira Winfrey, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook. Katira, thank you.